yard sale finds, completely random video. Uh, some really cool stuff that we've found this year uh, that I didn't really have time to fit in a different video. Sneak peek. Let's get right to it. We're going to make a quick video, uh, some random stuff that we didn't really have time to fit into any other videos. This is all stuff that we found at yard sales in the last month or two. Um, that's just been kind of on the side or stuff that I picked up for myself that I really like. Uh, we'll start off with a couple DVDs that I found. Tommy Boy, the Holy Schneike edition. Um, absolutely loved this movie growing up. Of course, what adolescent boy didn't like this movie in the 90s, early 2000s? Uh, fantastic movie. I didn't have this one on DVD. Um, and so figured I'd have it in the collection. I'm sure it's streaming somewhere. Um online but uh figured i'd have it on dvd really cool there so there's that one uh big star wars nerd so i picked up a couple of these at a buck a piece picked up the last jedi this one's been opened obviously um but all intact there still so really cool there and then picked up the uh last jet or the force awakens steelbook edition still sealed i got this for a buck so, couldn't pass that up. So those are the DVDs that I have. Uh, you notice in the background here, this is a 2018 Masters embroidered pin flag. A um, little bit big to have to, to have closer to the camera, but they sell these at Augusta National, I believe, and they're designed for autographs. So they're designed for the golfers uh, as they're coming off the course or um, maybe at the range or whatever. If you can catch them there, you can get them to sign these. And a lot of them that I see, um, like Jack Nicholas, uh, if they sign them, they're, they're selling for hundreds of dollars. These by themselves, unsigned, are selling on eBay for about 50 bucks, uh, anywhere between 40 and 60. And uh, cool find there, paid five bucks for that at a yard sale. Saw it, had to have it. I thought it was super cool. Uh, not sure if I'm going to hang on to it for the man cave here or. Uh, Try to sell it at a show. I don't really have too much need for golf stuff, but super cool item there. Love that. Um, and if I can make a couple bucks on it and kind of feed the habit of finding stuff at yard sales, um, great. I'll do that too. But the one thing that I wanted to share in this video is this guy. 1995 Streetwise Street Sharks, the Slugger Slamu. This guy is so cool, and I got him in a dollar bin. You can see right here on the butt, it says 95 Streetwise Designs, China. So, pick this up. I don't think I ever had one of these when I was a kid. If I did, I don't remember it. Um, but I remember vividly the commercials for these. And they always looked so cool. I think, was there even a TV show for these two? I don't really know. Um... But super cool. The boxing actions still work. So um, my son has claimed this for his own shelf. Really cool there. If I were to sell this guy, um, I could probably get 25 to 40 bucks for him. Um, believe it or not. And he's not in fantastic condition. He's got some scuffs on him um, by the lip there. You can see a scuff and there underneath, underneath the lip on that side. Um, not perfect condition, but I mean, for being a 30 year old toy, um, looking pretty darn good. So really cool item. My, my son loves having him on his shelf just to look at. It. I told my son, you can't really play with these. Of course, he's pretty, uh, pretty sturdy. So, uh, even if he did try to play with them, he'd be just fine. So not sure if we'll hang on to him for good or if we'll just, uh, try to sell them if I ever do a toy show or something, but figured I'd share that with you guys. Um, such a cool little find at a yard sale. And uh, yeah, hope you like the shorter shorter video style. I have a couple other things that I'm gonna share with you guys in future videos that we've picked up um, earlier this year and even at the end of the year last year that I've kind of held on to. Um, but yeah, figured I'd share the Street Sharks with you, the Slugger Slamu, super cool find for a buck at a yard sale. So yeah. Uh, again, if you have any questions about collectibles or um, want to comment on the video, great. I'll definitely respond. And uh, if you have a question, I'll try to answer it. If I can't answer it, I may just ignore the comment. No, I'm just kidding. I'll still have some kind of response for it. So thanks again for watching and uh, hope you enjoyed.